It's a magical, magical age we live in today when we can have a... Um, do, do we remove the uh, final punchline to that? Uh, oh, wait, we, we the app crashed. Oh, the app, okay. <laughs> I'm Evan Dushevsky, features editor of PCMag.com. <laughs> this is uh, Carol Mangus, managing editor of PCMag.com, making her One Cool Thing debut, because this okay. is One Cool Thing. This is the show every day at 10 a.m. Eastern here on Facebook. We talk about one very cool thing. Mm -hmm. And today, we have a very cool thing. Carol, what do we have? Okay, well, this is um, the product uh, that I built out of the Lego Boost Creative Toolbox. <laughs> This is a new product from Lego. It's a mm -hmm. coding and robotics kit mm -hmm. for younger kids. Mm -hmm. um, most people are familiar with their Mindstorms kits. Sure. Um, these are for, this is for kids who are seven and up. Okay. So it's a little more accessible, a little simpler, yeah. but with a you know, classic Lego quality. Right. So. Okay, uh, I, oh, she also, also mentioned that the other part of this show is that we want to hear from you. So if you have any comments, questions, drop them in the comments and social people will read them throughout the show. That's an important part of the show. Okay, so this is uh, Lego Boost. You built this. Um, uh -huh. Okay, so it comes with the set and this is, there's different um, kits and instructions you can follow yeah. to build your own robot. So what robot do we have here? This is the, the it's called Felix the Cat, okay. um, although it has a bow, so it's a girl. Okay. I don't know. Um, which, which, is the, which is the female version of Felix? Uh, Felicia. Felicia? Love it. Hi, Felicia. <laughs> this is Felicia. Bye, Felicia. So yeah. the, the Lego Boost app will yeah. take you through building the whole thing. Um, this took me so many hours to build. I okay. can't even tell you, but it was really fun. And it's very satisfying once you get the thing going and you have it built. Um, Written instructions, like in a pamphlet, or do you have to? You follow everything's the app? everything goes through the app. Through, it has it has to be on iOS. There's it doesn't have to be. It can okay. do Android or iOS okay. tablets, and they are all, can all you the. Do it through a phone, or it has to be a tablet. It's better. For, yeah, I think the tablet is okay. necessary for just for size. Gotcha. gotcha. Um, so yeah, very easy to follow. Everything is uh, almost all the instructions are visual okay. as opposed to text. So cool. any. You know, little kids can build it. And you um, can save it, I, I hope, and like, and come back to it later. Oh, sure. Yeah, so oh, sure. Which I had to or, do. Or, or chores or something. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, it did take me a while. There's a lot of small pieces. So, mm -hmm. I think for the younger kids, parents yeah. might want to get involved and help them out sure. with that. And you want to be careful not to lose one tiny piece. Yeah. Because I build, this is almost every piece in the kit. If okay. you want to build the next project, like the, uh, they have a little, um, a uh, pickup truck yeah. and a, a really cute little robot that looks like Wally. -E. Right. Um, you have to take your project apart and use the same pieces. Right, right, right. So just keep track of those little pieces. Okay. So, and then, um, but there's not, it's not just like a model kit like Legos, as you might have seen in the open. Right. Uh, you can do stuff with it. So, what, what, maybe we want to try doing it again, our little uh, presentation? Uh, yeah, let's try that again. Yeah, yeah. All right. So, um, the, the base unit is called the Move Hub. Mm -hmm. That's what powers the whole thing. So, I just turned that on, and it is now, as you can see, connecting via Bluetooth to the tablet. Oh, it's Bluetooth, not Wi-Fi. It's Bluetooth. <laughs> okay. And you can see the kitty's awake. Yeah. All right. So I'm going to actually go into a, the birthday cake se section of the okay. app because that's more fun. Okay. Now it's connecting again. <laughs> can you hear it purring? And now it's the, really so cute. the sound is actually coming um, through the tablet and connect, it's, you're picking it up on the mic. So it doesn't come through the actual machine or the actual robot. It comes through your tablet. Through the tablet. So right. just make sure to keep your sound up on your tablet. Yeah. All right, okay. so I'm just, what I'm doing right now is I'm pulling little coding blocks up here. And what that means is the, each of these things has coding commands inside of them. So kids aren't actually learning a language per se, uh -huh. but um, it's really clear from the icons on the, on the little blocks what these things do. So it's the fundamentals of coding, knowing that if you put a certain command in a certain order, you can make something else happen. Exactly. Okay, which yeah. is very cool. So you're yeah. getting the principles while still having like a really good time. Sure. All right, so. And you're running the program. There he goes. This is the program I gave him. Okay, that keeps happening. Unfortunately, the app keeps crashing okay. on us. Okay. <laughs> this is battery powered. Um, yes, that's okay. right. You have to fill the little move hub with batteries before you can do anything with it. Okay, and it, I, it also looks like this is actually a conventional um, Lego size. So it has. So you could add on 
your own kind of like Lego pieces if you wanted to, probably. Absolutely. And kind yeah. of like make your own Lego device. You, you don't have to follow the instructions uh, exactly. Right. Yeah. Like, yeah. You can you can build on this once you, once kids have done the five projects. Yeah. They have a really good sense of how this thing works. Right. Right. They um, teach you how to build base models, and on the base models, you can create your own creatures, mm -hmm. give them your, your own movements, and that kind of thing. So you can really just take this as far as as you want to go with it, cool. which is, you know, great. And, you know, in Lego fashion, they'll have an online community. Yeah. So kids can upload their own creations, teach other kids how to do them, oh, cool. you know, give each other compliments on their projects and stuff like that. Okay. So, yeah. Uh, Facebook, you have a question. Can any tablet run that? Is that just iOS, Android? Um, any tablet, either iOS or Android, can, okay. can okay. use this. They're, they have to be a certain, you know, uh, level of OS, yeah. but and it's a, and, newer and ones. it's a free app. It's a free app, okay. free download as long as you buy the one hundred and sixty dollars right. kit. Okay, yeah, so let's talk about. So it's, this is one hundred and sixty dollars. Right. We have five um, go-to projects, but you can build your own stuff. Um, mm -hmm. And then you said there was the. Uh, this is for the younger kids, you know, seven around. They say so. seven to twelve. Okay, and then, and then what's next? The next level up is for uh, how much is that, and what what age group is that for? Oh, the Mindstorms kits yeah. run. Um, I think they started around three fifty. I'm not exactly okay, sure wow. of that, but they're yeah. definitely more expensive. They're more complicated. Yeah. They're more. Elaborate and uh, a little more technical. So, okay. um, this, this is, is a great way for, for Duplo. Yeah, Duplo set. <laughs> yeah, it's a it's a great way for younger kids to like sort of get started and get involved. Oh, very cool. Yeah. Okay. Now this is available now. It it is out now. Yeah. Okay. And so, what was the price of this again? One hundred and sixty for the kit, okay. which, as these kits go, is sure. really not bad. <laughs> yeah, I mean, especially STEM is an important thing. Uh, get your kids into like robotics, engineering, and things like that. That's uh, very important. Um, okay, so then we built this. Now there, these other devices, they can actually. This one does not move. The, the legs can do like little it's, movements. Yeah, it can sit down yeah. and stand up and and so forth. Wag its tail, but it yeah. doesn't actually travel. Right. Um, if you the other ones do. Yeah, if you yeah. build one of the vehicles or the the robot, this mm -hmm. guy here who yeah. looks like Wally. Yeah. Um, this little playmat um, is actually helpful to kids Bernie. to learn Vernie the, the Robot. <laughs> um, each of the squares on this mat corresponds to one movement exactly. in the coding block, mm -hmm. so it teaches kids that sort of one-to-one -one relationship between mm -hmm. The coding and the action of the of the robots. Now, and, and to set this off, at least with this program, you d it did it with these external pieces. It wasn't yes. you hitting a button, right? Yeah, yeah. So I'll show you how that works. Um, this particular robot, you ha you have a um, color sensor mm -hmm. built into the front, right? Mm -hmm. All right. So I'm going to have to connect him again. So now he's connecting Happens to. Pretty fast. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty fast. We also I also note that we have we're kind of in a. Um, that's a good word. A menagerie of, of Bluetooth <laughs> and wireless signals all over our labs here, so it might be getting a little confused. All right. So, yeah. uh, so I'm going to start with, I'm going to have him uh, drink from his bottle. I mean, her bottle. Felicia. Yeah. All right. So this is the bottle, and it should respond to this color. Oh, I have to press it first. Okay. Okay, that little <laughs> last sound you heard is probably one of the most, you know, uh, fun features of this. Sure. Um, I don't know of any other robotics kit that lets you program a fart into your robot. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, in fact, it has a whole spectrum of them, like every. Oh, different kinds of farts. Yeah. Sure. Every time you move another fart code block, let's up, do it. Let's it'll, do it. It'll do a different sound. Yeah, All right, yeah. I'll do a bunch of them, because. Because why if, not? <laughs> if you have one of these at home, there's going to be a lot of farting noises. Let's just be honest. Okay. It's drinking. I guarantee you, you're going to hear a lot of that if you buy this product. It's, a, it's just a ma magical age we live in where, oh, where totally. any kid can build this. Um, okay, so, so that's super cool. Okay, so mm -hmm. then you have now this comes with the set, but you don't yeah. need, in theory, if you lost this, you damaged it, this is kind of just uh, a visual thing. It, it does, yeah. You don't need this pad. No, yeah. it's an accessory. Okay. It's just an, another thing to, you know, to teach and to play with. For gotcha. these things. Now, is this the only only one you've built? That's the only one I built okay. yeah. um, because who has time? Right, right. Like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I would I would actually love to be able to build the other ones. Sure, sure. I don't. Know. Okay, very cool. So, okay, so then we're, for the seven to six year old um, kind of age group, seven to seven, twelve, seven to twelve. Yeah, it matters on your kids, you know, particular. It skills. depends on your kids. Like some yeah. kids are really patient and they love yeah. to do these like long involved projects. Yeah. Other kids may be a little less patient. They and might need to get a little older or yeah, yeah. have some more help. And I'm gonna assume no soldering, no glue. No, this is all just like this snap is all Legos, and Legos yeah. are great. I mean, they yeah. fit 
together if you if you're really well legos they'll probably be able to handle this yeah totally yeah um yeah just like i said be careful with the pieces because you need every single yes. one of them i spent and a lot also, of my time searching for yeah. like the little wee blue one <laughs> as any parent knows or anyone who lives like in the house with uh, little people around stepping on legos really painful really hurts <laughs> um facebook you have a question when you graduate from lego boost what's the next step um, and the next step, if you stay in the Legos family, would be the Mindstorms kits. Mm -hmm. And um, I think the, the, the one that we've reviewed that we gave an editor's choice to is the EV Mindstorms, mm -hmm. which is a terrific kit for slightly older kids. Um, and I think that what they learn with this kit will take them naturally into, right. into that. But there are other kits available, too, if yeah. people want to shop around. Um, we just looked at one from Sony that's not actually available yet. It's called the Sony Couve kit. Mm -hmm. And it's also very, for younger kids, and very accessible. Right. So... Um, there are actually more and more of these products coming out that are designed to have, sort of bring kids into STEM painlessly and mm -hmm. in a fun way. And these are just some of the uh, extra pieces out. Yeah, <laughs> that's like pretty much all that's left. Right, right. So, um, yeah, if I wanted to build like the robot, I have to take this guy completely apart and use the, reuse the pieces. Oops, um, all right, I'm you're sorry. breaking my bot. Yeah. <laughs> I just wanted to give her a little hat. His like, eye keeps falling off. off. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, Felicia. Sorry. Okay, so let's also look into the app a little bit. What sure. There? Okay, so um, okay. when you... Oops, hang on one second. Mm -hmm. when, you first, when you first start, mm -hmm. I'm going to try to get back to the, uh, the main interface here. Mm -hmm. um, so the main interface shows you all the different projects you can build. <laughs> Um, the very first project is a small vehicle you'll build that takes very little time to build. Okay. It just gives you the oh gosh, that's loud. Yeah. It gives you the basics of, of what this is going to do. Right. And then you can pick any one of the five other projects to, to go to next. Okay. And so let's say I want to build the uh, this is a sort of a it's kind of a 3D printer. I don't okay. know what else to call it. It will. You, it will build little Lego creatures for you. Okay. It's like a little tiny Lego builder factory. So it's really cool. You build a machine that builds other Lego yes. creatures. Crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah I yeah. love that. Yeah, yeah. I, I, no, maybe is, I'll is, build that one. Is this a lock? <laughs> um, it's locked because you have to complete the first so phase. It's like a game. It's kind of like a game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, you have to complete certain phases before you can get to okay. Very cool. the more complicated ones. So that takes kids naturally through the learning process. Gotcha. So you can see, like, this, this first step here is unlocked. These guys are locked. Um, and this is how you start. You just go through it. It shows you exactly the pieces you need, how they fit together. It's really easy to follow, as long as you can locate the pieces right, right. <laughs> that you need. Like, I just had them all in a big jumble. Yeah. I would really advise people to, like, separate them by color or size right, right, right. and just make them easier don't, to... Don't do this. Don't do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Cool. So yeah. that's it's very step by step, and yeah. if any kids like avail um, has any familiarity with like touchscreen games, which in this age they do, mm -hmm. uh, they'll probably be able to follow this. Oh yeah, yeah it's yeah. I, it's if I could, kids can Definitely. believe me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, very cool. Uh, Pete, do we have any more questions? Uh, I think we're all set. Okay, um, so all right, so let's brass tacks. Um, uh, you, you you wrote a review for this. Yes, up on the site now. Uh huh. Okay. Um, what did you give it? Um, I gave it a four and a half. Okay, that's very and good. And an editor's choice. Editor's choice, okay. Because it's pretty, it's pretty seamless. Okay. I, I think it's a great idea, and cool. I think kids will really enjoy it. Cool. And then, you know, uh, holiday season coming up, birthdays and stuff. This is a great gift. Mm -hmm. um, very cool. Carol Magus, thank you so much for joining us. Um, join us here every day at 10 a.m. Eastern here on Facebook for one cool thing. We'll be back tomorrow at 10 a.m. Eastern here on Facebook uh, w w with another very cool thing. See y'all. Bye. Farting robots for life. <laughs> Bye, Felicia. Bye, Felicia.